perhaps their key man today, goalkeeper Tony Norman. The Welsh international has been in cracking form. I fancy he's going to be busy today. How well he copes could decide the result. Still forward. Right across goal, Atavel shot small. Oh, how did he save it? He couldn't have known too much about it. Uh, oh, and another fabulous save from Tony Norman. Well, he's stopping everything at the moment. Brilliant saves. Look at that. Clawed away with the truck. The best fell to Paul Bowden, smashing his first time volley on target. Norman pulling off some spectacular acrobatics. Glenn Hoddle was leading from the front, his vision setting up numerous attacks. He came close to putting his side ahead, but again, Norman was well positioned. First, Norman balanced his books with flying reactions to Mark Barham's header. Joe Allen came close to a place on the score sheet, but saw his effort denied by a splendid one-handed save from Tony Norman. Well, Nick, but just got a turn. And Gale hit it well, and Norman reacted beautifully. Elliot waiting on the edge of the area. Was well away from him. Chelsea beginning to look more like a first division team now. They've got a lot of players in the centre. Oh, and another astonishing save from Dennis Wise's header from really a matter of inches. Norman got to it and got it up over the bar. Great build up from Chelsea and a great early crossing from the left hand side. Terrific reflexes there from Tony Norman. I don't know how he kept that out. It must have been three yards outward. Retrieved here by Jones. Turn towards the goalkeeper. Clark. It's a fine ball for Dixon. How did he keep it out? Tony Norman with a glorious save for Sunderland. Yeah, it was a great cross in there, and uh, the right back's got the wrong side of Dixon there. A great opportunity for him, and a good reflex save. Again, and pulled it back for Paul Cook to let fly. Norman on top form to turn his shot round the post. Some He's given the throw to Aston Villa, and Sunderland were caught completely flat-footed. Flat to Cascarino. Aston Villa can't believe their luck, and they can't make the use of it either. This time, uh, Cascarino... Uh, just couldn't round it all off, one-on-one -on -one against Tony Norman. Stuart Pearce on one of his many forward runs finds Roy Keane with space in the box and it's Philip Starbuck on the end of a move bringing the best out of Tony Norman. Kevin Sheedy up against Tony Norman. A wonderful instinctive save. By McLaren, McLaughlin to Duncan Shearer, back to White, McPhail, White, Oh, what a wonderful move and a super finish. And a wonderful save from Tom and Tony Norman. A wonderful move built up there and a good shot by Wise and a super save. Gets past three men. He's into the box. Here it is for Jones. Oh, wonderful save by Tony Norman again. Going the wrong way, but stuck out the leg and kept it out. That is White. There's three men in the box. Can he pick one out? Cheer up. Goal. Oh, what a save. Fantastic Tony Norman save. Jackson on a good run. Keeps going. He's through and a good save by Norman. Looking for small. He got to it and Tony Norman had to make a save. Tony Norman, age 34, goalkeeper. On a couple of occasions, he actually kept his in the cup, you know, although it's a team game. Uh, everybody would acknowledge that some of his saves have uh, 
have kept us in this cup run and got us this far. And there are a few bad dresses and uh, I'd say Tony is probably one of the worst. You know, he actually turned up to our bad taste Christmas party wearing his normal gear. So that uh, says it all about Tony.